Hey guys and girls, what is up? It's Dan Electro327 here, and it's a sad, sad day. Not for me. Don't, nothing, nothing's wrong, other than the U.S. government. I haven't done a complaint about the U.S. government video because I live in the U.S. and I enjoy our government. It works, but there's some things that they should not be able to touch and that would be our freedom of speech and there's a new bill or I guess technically it's an old bill but it, they've been bumming it around in Congress for a while and negotiations and arguments and everything just resumed uh, today actually the 21st of December and Everyone knows that placing copyrighted material and things like that online, especially on places like YouTube, makes it subject to being taken down. Fair enough. Uh, private companies do that all the time. It's kind of an accepted way that stuff works. And and I can accept that, because, you know, that that is what happens if you're doing stuff that they don't like and they have contracts and everything that you sign and you have like a participation contract or whatever like like YouTube does fair enough because they'll take down copyrighted material all the time and all the more power to them keeping legality into it and keeping people from getting ripped off and things of that sort but this bill in Congress right now is about censorship on a government level and basically what YouTube does is they'll go in and if they they have either a computer or a group of people or something I haven't really done it I only have a copyright notice on one of my videos and it's a n don't do anything it doesn't really matter type of thing but that's that's fine uh, but when this is one of the most direct things about this that I heard. Some, I guess it was hip hop artists, so I guess some rappers. They heard about something about Universal Music or like the big, really big recording music studio label. I don't know. But they heard something about them doing something that they didn't like. So they collaborated on a song and they put it on YouTube because I think it was freedom of speech or freedom of expression that was the main like that they thought this I guess was universal music I'm just gonna say that I really needed to read up on it more but I decided not to I decided to go in here blind and just give you my what I've heard uh, mostly hearsay um, but some fact because I do enjoy factual things and they put a song on YouTube that was speaking out against universal music is I told you that's what I'm gonna give this company I'm pretty sure it is universal music though and uh, universal music wasn't happy so they actually took that video down like off of YouTube and the rappers were like how how can you do that? There was no, and the m music was taken down. And when it was taken down, it was because of a copyright violation. But all of the rappers had written the song. There was no copyright. Oof, lag spike. Even though I'm not doing it, there was no copyright vi violation. It was all original work. It was all done by these rappers, basically done by these hip hop artists. But when YouTube had first started out or something of that sort, they made YouTube to be able to post music and things of that sort and without just having everything broken down and then getting sued for much, much money. And this is after like a year, years lawsuit between YouTube and Universal Music. Again, don't know if that's it. That's what I'm going with. I think I said that six times. But just keeping with that, after a really, really long lawsuit, 
YouTube decided to give copyright viewing rights, I guess, is what you could call it. It was basically, it gave them the right, it gave them the power to go onto the YouTube site, remove any video, regardless of content, copyright infringement, there, there literally had to be no reason other than the fact that they just didn't want the video there. And I guess Universal Music has this power to just, doesn't matter what they think is wrong with your video, if they find something that does, they don't like in your video, it's a weird pit. But if they find something they don't like, if something that is bashing them, but at the same time being truthful, like these rappers speaking out how Universal Music had suppressed their right of expression or something by not doing stuff, I don't know the, the logistics or anything else. They took it down and the rappers were like, what? And so they found all this out that like Universal has these exclusive rights to take down whatever they want. And you you should be terrified of this. Because this isn't just, oh, whatever, they can take down stuff if they don't de- This is corporate censorship. This is, if they felt like it, they could choose whole swaths of content and get rid of it just because they didn't like the, the message if it was speaking out against them or something of that sort. And this should terrify you because this means whatever they decide is in their interest as a business, not as a service, as a business, can apply to anything. So they have the power that if it suits them in a, if it suits them in a way that they could make more money if that content wasn't there, they can get rid of that just because they feel like it. The clause in, or the bill in government right now, is, it's an anti-piracy act. It's dealing with copyright infringement and stuff like that. Like, kind of what YouTube does, but it takes it to a ridiculous, rid almost, yeah, I'd, I have to, it takes it to a ridiculous level. To the point where, if there are loopholes, what is going on? There are loopholes and things like that that the government could use to their advantage that would allow them, if they really felt like it, if they felt that there was a website that was a danger to peace or some BS that would suit them and they could give rights to corporations. But they could take down whole websites. Just we think there's stuff on this that is harmful to the public opinion, and so we're gonna get rid of it. That that that's that could be their reason. That's it. Is we don't agree with this. So guess what? Your site's done by using. I think it's called NS blocking, and it's a system that's been used by. Ch Black Spikes, again, is a system that's been used by multiple countries to block certain sites that they deem aren't in the... I stare at you, Enderman. Hey, and... Right, Mr. Enderman? I stare at you. And massive nuts creepers. I stare at you. Hey, bro. Whoa. So off topic right now. Come at me, bro. Whatever. And so they could. Wow. I just got really distracted there. That has happened to me in forever. So the government could basically block. Fall down the hole. You know you want to.
Heh <laughs> I'm above water. But it would basically allow the government to do whatever they wanted. But at the same time, the only thing this would benefit is corporations, because this is what it's written in for is these whew, is these corporations that could now censor the internet, which this should scare you. Corp government censorship not so much because the people have a say in it. It's kind of the way it works. The, the people have a say in it, but a, a lot of what runs government at this point is really, really large corporations that can run these lobbying firms to get whatever they want done. So, this would be government censorship, but it wouldn't. It would be corporate sponsorship because they could pay the government. They could pay lobbyists to lobby to the government to do different things. And that should scare you because that's bordering on corporate sponsorship, which means whatever they deign necessary to keep their monetary system, whatever, their monetary solutions going is what they'll do. So things like YouTube where people post content and things like that, that's gone because there's copyright stuff on there. So they'll just say, no, we don't, we don't want your copyright stuff anymore. And that's done with. And also, not related to corporations and monetary things, this amount of censorship, which YouTube does. YouTube does censorship. I have copyright notices on a video of mine. It's not that big of a deal. They just tell you if it happens. If you continue, they'll block it. If you continue to circumvent it, they will take advanced measures. Like if they remove your account, if they block you from posting and you somehow circumvent that, they will take more drastic measures. Which is okay. That's that's okay if it's a private company where you sign an agreement when you start posting videos saying, I understand that posting copyright stuff could get these videos taken down and continuing to do it could get me in trouble. You have to accept that when you sign up for YouTube. But when YouTube does it, it's like... It's really individualized. It's, if you do this, you're gone. The way that the SOPA Act works, where YouTube say that they're, say that there's a bank. Let's, let's use a simple analogy that, let's, whatever. Say that there's a bank. Say that there is a safety deposit box in that bank. Now say that this bank was somewhere in, let's say, UK or somewhere where guns aren't allowed, guns would of course be representing copyrighted material. Now in that safety deposit box, in this one bank, there is a gun. The police are doing some random searches for some random reason. They suspect something or something of that nature. They search the safety deposit box. They find this gun. But instead of just punishing or convicting or arresting the man who has this this one man who has this gun they instead of doing that they shut down that bank every branch of that bank and the corporation of that bank worldwide so they just destroy this bank basically they just get rid of it they get rid of the entire company that this bank is that is kind of what this SOPA Act will do it will allow government slash corporations to go in and say we don't agree with this website so this entire website's coming down because you have one thing that is copyright on your website which w this soap act would give them the idea to do there's another act that's following it called um, protect IP which doesn't sound so harmless at first it's like oh you're protecting my IP address no this is a bill that I don't know the parameters of it. I was mo this was mostly a video focused on SOPA, but it's another bill they're trying to sneak in behind SOPA. So if people are like, whoa, SOPA is a little bit too extreme. Oh, this protect IP. This sounds good. It could be just as harmful. And I might link in the description, or I might put an annotation, probably up in my upper right hand corner, 
a link to a video by uh, Total Biscuit because he did a really in-depth description of this this bill and all of this stuff. And if you guys are in the United States, write to your local to your local uh, representative in Congress, telling them to stop this bill because. Because they basically have people debating this bill that don't even know what they're doing. And for more, for really, really in depth, this is just kind of like a get your eyes open, um, stuff like that. You really need to watch the video that I am linking in, on my video or in the description, one of the two. Because Total Biscuit, great, great commentator. He, he's been doing this forever. I'm basically new to this whole thing. Um,. Hopefully one day I'll be as good as him. Hoping. But, um, yeah, he he goes into really good depth, and he has some really good examples that I'm blanking out on right now, and I'm being really stupid. But, guys, um, really get, get active about this, because this could ruin the Internet, basically. And, again, Total Biscuit goes into way, way, way more detail, but basically this is a really big problem that you need to be watching out for. Um, thanks for listening to me. I know this was kind of boring. It was just kind of me ranting to Minecraft in the background. Um, I guess I'll see you guys later. Please, please get active about this. Spread the word. We need to stop this bill cold. And after SOPA, we need to stop Protect IP because they could destroy YouTube, basically, is the extent of what these could do. Alright, I'll see you guys later.